What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Lyman Football. Now this is the first video in the brand new series called Settle It. Now how that series works is I come up with things that we want to settle on the Instagram page and then we vote on those, we create a bracket on the best options for these, we bracket them down and the community votes on the best product for different linemen. So the first video is going to be what is the best D lineman face mask. Now how that works is I put up a bunch of different options that you could have on your face mask on Instagram. I pulled it. I created a bunch of different designs with badass masks. Then with those designs, we created a bracket and then we voted on the best one. Once you found that best one, you vote and it is sent to a winner. Now before that product goes to that winner, it first comes to me. I can put the video out on it and then I ship it out to that winner. All right, we had the first settle it here for the best D lineman face mask voted by over like, like 5,000 of you guys between all the different polls. So let's get into it, let's unbox it and then I'll ship it right off. All right, so here we have the package. Now I'm sorry if you hear my furnace in the background, my furnace is running, there's nothing I can do. It's still kind of cold in Canada. So um, we still have to have that run to keep the heat going. But let's get into this. So this is the mask created by myself and Badass Masks. Again, the winner has already been announced. He already knows it'll be coming his way. We have this on the top and then just open that up. So first he gave me a couple decals as he does with all his things here. Badass mask, BA mask he goes by. Just a couple of these stickers. Ooh. He gave me some big ones here. If I did want to put these on the side of a helmet, which I might actually do, this could be really cool. Check those out. Finally what we wanted. Here is the top rated D lineman face mask. So as you can see on the pole, some of the different accessories were really tight between like different types of slanted bar. Uh, the U bar versus the bull bar were very, very close. We also had a couple of the different eye guard accessories being really close as well. And we came up with some different options and this is the one that was voted on as the favorite mask here. Now a couple of the identifying features of this mask. First off, we did make it for a speed because I don't have a speed flex at the moment to show these on. We voted on the slanted bars facing this way, mirrored on both sides. Also voted on was to have the bull bar at the top, kind of similar to what Sheldon, Danny Sheldon? Whatever Sheldon currently wears, I don't remember what team he's on right now. We also added on the sides a set of eye guards to help protect yourself. And that's pretty much it. We left it with a medium open on the top so you could still fit a visor very easily or keep it like this and have less risk of your fingers going in. Uh, Overbuilt face masks are getting less popular, but kind of medium built face masks are kind of in right now where it's not a ton, a ton of bars, but it's still not enough where you can get your fingers through it in all these different ways. So now that you've seen the mask, let's put it on a helmet. Let's check it out. So there you guys go. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode and I hope you're happy that I'm back. Um, if you like this video, don't forget to obviously hit like so I know what you guys want to see and also comment down below what other Settle It series you want. I have a couple in the works right now, but I'd love to get your opinion. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and as always, thanks.